The Democratic Alliance, by all accounts, has some work and perhaps some soul-searching to do ahead of the local government elections next year. That's if the party's performance in Wednesday's by-election is dissected. The party lost nine wards. The good news, it retained 14. The biggest winner is the ANC retaining 64 wards and winning six new wards. The African National Congress retained 64 wards, lost two wards, and won six new wards. The Democratic Alliance retained 14 wards, lost nine wards, and won two new wards. The Encarta Freedom Party retained four wards, won one new ward. The Patriotic Alliance one, one new ward. The Good Party, one, one new ward. The IEC says overall voter turnout was under 40%. People participated despite by-election taking place at an uncertain time where safety and sanitation were paramount as the country still grapples with COVID-19. We're still counting of, uh, because the, there's a staffing cost that comes uh, in after we've got to check whether people did turn up all of them uh, some of them may have been um, assigned to work but may not have arrived and so on so um, that element of the cost um, uh, is currently indeterminate uh, on ppe alone we spent in the order of three million um, just to cover uh, our staff the IEC says its preparation for local elections next year is well underway. It's in consultation with the Department of Corporate Governance and Traditional Affairs with regards to the exact dates on which this will take place. Heidi Jokos, Centurion.